Hey angels, welcome back to Unique Mystery. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful, blessed, and beautiful Saturday. And you're starting your day off right and positive. So this is a story time, angels. This story time is about uh, when I went to Subway. What happened to me when I went to Subway. And this happened to me like a few nights ago. So, me and my sister, we decided that we wanted some yummy subs from Subway. We didn't feel like going in. We just wanted to go through the drive-thru, quickly get a sandwich, and just leave, okay? So, we went to the drive-thru. I was driving, so I ordered, you know... A foot long sub for me and my sister. I ordered the sub and then I pulled to the window after I was done. So after I paid for it at the window, I asked the lady, I said, Can I have, you know, a side order of pickles? and jalapenos because if you don't know by now angels I love me some pickles I love jalapenos too but mostly pickles and like every time I get a sandwich from any place like I have to have extra pickles before I'm satisfied but isn't that what it's all about when you go to a restaurant when you go to a restaurant or any place and you want a sandwich or whatever you want you just want it your way and you're supposed to get it your way if you want extra pickles you're supposed to ask for extra pickles and it shouldn't be a problem right well anyways the first night we went to subway and then like I said after I ordered um, the sandwich and paid for it at the window I asked the woman for extra pickles can I have a side of pickles and a side of jalapenos so I noticed that she didn't say anything to me you know she just closed the window but when she came back she had a side order of pickles and jalapenos and you know I noticed that first night she was rude so I was like okay whatever you know I tried not to pay it any mind so we left okay so the next night we wanted to come back to subway so we went back to subway again same thing the same woman was there ordered the subway sandwich pulled to the window and again I said can I have a side order of okay the second night when I asked, when I pulled to the window, there was another woman waiting on me. She was another woman doing my order. But the woman from the prior night was in there also. So I asked the other woman, I said, yes, can I have a side order of pickles and jalapenos? So she said, okay, and she was about to go get me my side order of pickles and jalapenos. And I overheard the other woman in the back, you know, from the previous night, stomped off and said, kind of yelling, saying, she asked for the same thing last night. So I'm thinking, is that a problem? that's how I like my subs so of course anytime I come to Subway that's what I'm gonna ask for a side order of pickles and jalapenos because I'm paying for the sandwich so I can at least get it exactly how I want right so when she did that she stumped off screaming saying she did that same thing last night so I told the other woman I was like hold on that's okay you don't have to get me um, the pickles and the jalapenos because if she's reacting this way then I'm not gonna even trust to eat those pickles and jalapenos 
like I said, I did not ask her anyways. You know, the other lady was waiting on me, but when I said it, the other woman stumped off in the back like she was going to make them, but she was screaming saying she asked for the same thing last night. So I said, no, that's okay. I don't want those pickles and jalapenos. Never mind. So, like I said, we was at the window, so I was about to pull off, but then my mind was like, nah, I'm not just going to let this fly because, like, usually, you know, I could understand if somebody is having a bad day and, you know, I try to pay them no mind, but I feel like this was, like, you was going too far. This was going over the hill. You're going to scream and say, oh, she did that same thing last night. That's just, that's too much. And you're working in a restaurant, so you have a problem with giving me a sandwich exactly the way I want it. Okay, so I had to, you know, end up not getting my pickles and jalapenos because with behavior like that, I'm not going to trust anybody bringing me food, you know, because if they get that upset and mad, who knows what they'll do to my food. So I said, yeah, I said that was okay. I was about to pull off, but I changed my mind, came back to the window because I was going to ask um, the other woman that was um, waiting on me. I was going to ask her what the other lady's name was because I was going to do a complaint on her. So I came back to the window, sat there for like five minutes. And then the uh, the woman that I wanted to do the complaint on, she came out, but she did not look to the window, but she saw me setting to the window. And she did not come to the window at all. She just went to the cash register, started doing something, and then was like cleaning up a little bit. And she never turned around and looked at me, but when she came out, she saw me. But she just never came to the window and see what I wanted another rude thing so then I walked in I decided to go in subway so I went in subway once again I was just standing up there because at this point I knew they saw me standing up to the cash register but nobody wanted to come out so I stay standing there and I saw the other woman and when I could get her attention in the back I you know I told her you know come here so she comes to the cash register and I said, um, yeah, I wanted to know what um, the other woman that was screaming, I wanted to know what her name was because I'm going to be doing a complaint on her. So she told me her name and she also told me that she was their manager. Okay, I don't care, you know, that makes it even worse. You're a manager. And you're acting that way because somebody asked you for a side order of pickles and jalapenos? Then you definitely have a problem, okay? You don't need to be working at a restaurant if you have a problem with somebody coming there wanting their sandwich a certain way. Then you need to go work someplace else. <clears throat> you need to go work someplace else. This is not the place for you because... People are going to come there every day with different sandwich and food requests. So, if you're going to be that crazy and go off yelling and screaming just because somebody asks for pickles and jalapenos, then you get a temper and an attitude, then you do not need to be working at Subway. So, I got her name and... Um, I went back home and I was calling... <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. I'm kind of hoarse because I'm. I still had this um aggravating cold, but I got her name and I went back home. And that day it was snowing. It was bad weather, and I was calling like the head subway because I wanted to make a complaint, but nobody answered. So I was assuming that everybody was, you know, they didn't come into work because of the weather. So, I haven't made the complaint yet, but I still will be making this complaint because I have her name written down. And I know the subway 
location that I was at so I will be making this complaint soon so angels tell me what you think about this subway story time have you ever went to a restaurant and asked for something and you wanted it a certain way and the manager or the people working there got upset because you wanted extra pickles or jalapenos or you just wanted something you know extra and you wanted it your way let me know and tell me what you think you think that um if this happened to you would you make a complaint on that person okay angels thanks so much for listening to this story time don't forget to give this video a thumbs up comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video <clears throat> bye angels